this class we were doing about cryptography right that is the coding okay so we will start now with the uh, second one okay second one we would we have to start now now second one what they have told us match the following okay so here this side they have given the words like max mathematics addition subtraction multiplication division and this side they have given some coding things and what you have to do is match the following like see the alphabet a is there no for a alphabet you have to code it as 0 0 for b alphabet you have to write it as 0 1 like that you have to code the alphabets okay you have to code the alphabets and you need to see what uh, this one will come for that so we will start now the first one you have is m a t h e m a t i c s so we will see what is that okay so here you have the codings what we did yesterday yes so this is c for m when you see that is here you have c for a you have 0 0 for b you have 0 1 for c you have 0 2 for d you have 0 3 0 4 0 5 like that you have okay so the first alphabet you have is m so what is your m over here you see like that you have to check okay your m over here is what 12 here you can check where is your m this is your m over here okay your m represents what 12 so instead of m what you have to write 12 Okay, so if you want, this is the third row letter, okay. Second row letter, third row letter, both are same only. If you want, you can write this table first and then start your second row letter. Okay, that is A stands for 0, 0, B stands for 0, 1, C stands for 0, 2, D stands for 0, 3, E stands for 0, 4, F stands for 0, 5, G stands for 0, 6, like that. Continuously, you have to write. Okay, that is J. Then you have K, K is 10. Like that. So these are the coding things. Okay. So based on this you need to write the word mathematics. So here what you have. For M what you have 12. For A you have 0 0. Okay. For A you have 0 0. Then T. For T what you have. T you have 19. Okay. This is your 19. T you have 19. Next one is E. E you have 0 4. M you have 12. Again A you have 0 0. T you have 19. So I you have 0, 8. Like that you have. Okay. So which one, which option will come? You have to see. That is 12, 0, 0, 19, 0, 7, 0, 4, 12, 0, 0, 19, 0, 8, 0, 2, 18. Which is the option you have to see. So when you see the options, you have the C option. Right. In match the following, you have the C option as this one. So this is your answer. Okay. So for M, M you have to write uh, this one 1 2 for A you have to write 0 0 for T you have to write 19 for H you have to write 0 7 for E you have to write 0 4 for M you have to write this A 0 0 and like this state S. S you have 18. Okay. So when you combine all this see which option you are getting. So you will get for the first one you will get the C option. Okay. So C option you have to tick in the textbook for 1. The next one what you have is addition. A D D I T I O N. So again you see the codes. Okay. So here you have for A what you have. For A you have 0 0. For D what you have 0 3. A D D then I. For I what you have 0 8. T. T you have 19. Okay. A D D I T I O N. So again you have this I. Then you have this O, then you have this N. Okay, so addition. So this will be what? For A, 0, 0. So 0, 0, 0, 3, 0, 3, 0, 8, 19, 0, 8, 14 and 13. This will be your addition. So which option will come? You have to check. So for this one addition, you will get which option? Uh, you have 12, 0, 0, that is the, which option you have is a D option. Okay, so this is your 0, 0, 0, 3, 0, 3, you have the D option. So, this one, second one is D option. Same way you do for subtraction. Now, subtraction, what you will get? 
for s you have 18 for u you have 20 for b you have this like this you put for all the alphabets okay s u b then t is 19 r is 17 a is 0 c is 0 2 t is 19 i is 0 8 0 0 uh, o is 14 and n is 13 so this will be your uh, subtraction that is which one um, a option okay your a option is your answer for the third one like this you complete for multiplication and for division okay you see the code here yeah, you see the code and then you write okay so first when you start this roman letter itself you write these codes okay leave some gap and write a 00 b 01 c 02 d like this fully till how much till z that is the last one z will be what this one uh, 29 okay like this you have to write for oh, 29 uh, this one so all the things you need to write Now we will start with the fourth one, okay. So please complete the remaining two, okay, as homework. Now we have the next Roman letter, that is frame additive Kiffer table. So this is how the table will be. Okay, this is how your Kiffer table will be. That is, you have A, 0, 0, B, 0, 1, C, 0, 2, D, 0, 4, E, 0, uh, this one, 0, 4, then 0, 5, 0, 6, 0, 7, 0, 8, 0, 9, and then for K you have 10. Okay, like this you have to put the table. So this will be 0, 4. Okay, that is key is 4. They have given the key as 4. So this will be 0, 4, then 0, 5, 0, 6, 0, 7, 0, 8, 0, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. From 0, 4 you have to start. Okay, because they have told the Kiffer table key is given as 4. So you will start from 0, 4. And then you have all these. That is, you have till uh, this one. Till Z. Okay. So, for uh, you it will be 24. The Kiffer will be 24. Then 25. Then 26. 27. 28. 29. So, this is how your Kiffer table will be. Okay. So, please note it down. Copy it. Okay. In your this one. So, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, S. Start from 0, 0. 0, 1, 0, 2. Okay. So for 0, 0, it's 0, 4. 0, 1, it is 0, 5. 0, 2, it is 0, 6. 0, 3, it is 0, 7. 0, 4, it is 0, 8. 0, 5, it is 0, 9. 0, 6, it is 10. 0, 7, it is 11. 0, 8, it is 12. 0, 9, it is 13. Okay. Like this. Please complete the table till how much? Z. That is 25. For that the Kiffer is 29. Now the next one, fourth Roman letter, what you have is a message like good morning written in reverse will would be, see, when you write the word good morning, what you will get? This is your G-O-O-D. When you take the reverse of that, what you will get? You will get D-O-O-G. Right? This will be D-O-O-G and morning. So this is your M-O-R-N-I-N-G. So when you take the reverse of that, what you will get? G-N-I-N-R-O-M. So like this, you have to see the statement and you have to write the reverse of that. So here they have given one statement in the book. O-T, D-N-A, T-S-T, like that and all they have given. Okay, the full statement they have given. So, what you have to do is, each and every word you have to reverse and write. Okay, so this is OT means what? When you reverse it, what you will get? TO2. This will be TO2. Then this will be, when you reverse this, you will get each, each word you have to reverse. Okay, so this will be U-N-D-E-R-S-T-A-N-D, understand. And then you have T-H-A-T, that. And then again you reverse this. So like this you have to reverse it and you have to frame a meaningful sentence. Okay, meaningful sentence you have to make. So here you have the answer. So what you have? First one is T-O-2, small t, no? 
so it's a to okay to to understand that mathematics can be experienced everywhere in nature and in real life okay to understand that mathematics can be experienced everywhere in nature and in real life okay so this is how you have to write that okay the reverse of that sentence you have to write okay so this completes your uh, fourth one okay this completes your fourth one so reverse that words what are given and make it as a meaningful statement to understand that mathematics can be experienced everywhere in nature and in real life so this completes your fourth one now the next thing what you have is again some coding type okay again some coding you have okay that is the code codes are given like this the codes are given like this and the codes are given like this when you see the mirror image of something um, vehicle number or something okay how it will be that is what they have given for the next exercise oh here the fifth one is there right fifth one uh, fifth one we have to do okay fifth one you have fifth one what they have given is decode the given cipher text and compare your answer to get the activity 3 result now what you have to do is see they have given some pattern you have to see this pattern and you have to write okay now when you see the first one the first one what they have given is the room number in which the treasure took place okay the room number in which the treasure took place so for that they have given a pattern like this okay you need to understand this pattern and you need to do okay like see here they have given this these are the codes okay they have given these are the codes so this is w this is a like this okay these are the different codes so you have to understand these codes and you have to write the answer okay it's very simple it's just logic okay so here you have two things like this now they have asked, what they are asking is they are asking the room number so here the first one will be what two this is the this one uh, b that is this one see this is your 2 and this is your 8 h okay h half so this is your 28 so you have to write the first answer the room in which the treasure took place is 28 Okay, the room in which the treasure took place is twenty-eight. So this is how you have to do the first one. Okay, next one. See, all these are only logical thinking sums. Okay, you won't be getting more sums for from this in the exam. Okay, since it's all interesting things we are doing. Okay, all coding types only. So the first answer is twenty-eight. Second one, what they have told us. the place of treasure okay the place of treasure for that they have given some codes now when you see this see this is c this is <clears throat> the previous one h okay this is a this is i and this is r so here you will get c h a i r that is j so here you will get the answer the place of treasure is chair okay the place of treasure is chair this is the this is how you will do that next one you have third one the name of the treasure okay so you have to uh, identify what is that so this is the first one the first one what you have is c this is your g okay g i f t and then this is the reverse that is the voucher v reverse no so this is v o u c h e r gift voucher like here this is the r no this is your r so this is gift voucher 
So here you have to write the name of the treasure is gift voucher. G I F T V O U C H E R. Okay, this is your gift voucher. So this completes your uh, this one fifth Roman letter. Okay, now we will go for next for the sixth Roman letter. The sixth Roman letter, what they have told us. Praveen recently got a registration number for his two wheeler. Here the number is given in the form of mirror image. Encode the image and find the correct registration number of Praveen's two wheeler. So here see they have given <coughs> the first one is TN. Okay, TN 12H2589. So which is the reverse of that you have to see. Now see this is TN 12H2. So this is your TN 12H2589.